Gabu Isyatan akan hadir untuk bercerita tentang The Legend of Situ Bagendit. Nah, dari mana yo ceritanya? Kita akan jalan-jalan ke Bogor. Eh, salah. Ke Garut. Iya. Nah, dengerin ya ceritanya ya. Ini cerita tentang Garut. Nah, The Legend of Situ Bagendit. Nah, nanti dengerin. Ya, nanti dengerin. Nanti ceritanya apa? Bapak tanyain nanti. Ya. Oke, dengerin itu. Oh, ceritanya. Andi Jinan Adibar, panggilannya apa? Jinan. Oh, Jinan. Ya, Jinan. Sana ada kamera. Udah siap? Kalau nggak siap, lampaikan tangan aja. Dewan Juri yang terhormat, kita sambut. Andi Jinan Adiba Pak Benten ya, salah tadi ya mohon maaf ya selamat menyaksikan Hi ladies and gentlemen good afternoon Thank you very much for the time given to me. Now, I'm Gina, would like to tell you a story entitled The Legend of Situ Bagadi. Have you heard the story before? Okay, let me tell you and listen to me carefully. Once upon a time in a small village in West lived a very young one. She lived in a very large and luxurious house filled with a lot of jewels. Her wealth was plentiful. However, she was really greedy and stingy. You can call her but kingdom. She was not her bad attitude. No, 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 no. I will 
and I'm letting them take away the water from my well. The water in the well is mine. So they found kidnapping. But it was there, the thirsty people outside the fence. A few days later, a very old man with a stick of wood came to her for asking the water. Yeah, Ibo can do. Please, give me just some drops of water. <coughs> I'm so thirsty. If you don't mind, I will take the water from your well. Ask the old man. Hey, the poor old man. I have a lot of water in my well, but I don't want you to take my water. Any drops of my water is only for me. No one can take any of it. Go away. But give your auntie, you are the richest person in this village. You have everything that you ever have before. You have not God. Wait for punishment from God. You will be punished. <laughs> You're right. I'm the richest person here. So no one can punish me, not even God. <laughs> Leave my house now. Say, but did that mean? But she probably went back to her big house. With the herd, the old man went by and he stood in the middle of Bagin and the house yard. He put the stick wood on the ground and said, Bagin Dandi, if you don't want to lose any of your water, now I will give you more water. Put the stick wood on the ground. Suddenly, the water came out and burst into the very country. The water kept coming out of the ground and flooded it all. What is this? Where does this water come from? Slowly, the flu swept all over from King Dandy in its house, and it turned into that. But King Dandy was drowned with all of the well, and people called it Situ Bagandi or Leg Bagandi. From this story, we can learn pretty nicely the answer to be structure. Well, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for your kind attention. And have a great day. Bye-bye. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.